Hello everyone, this is Dr. Ananya. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'll be talking about ANC profile test. Before beginning the video, I'd like you to subscribe to my channel so that I can share all the valuable and useful information with you. First of all, let us know what is ANC. ANC stands for antenatal care. Antenatal care profile test is a group of tests that is advised to pregnant women. This test can help monitor the maternal as well as fetal health. Nowadays, ANC profile test is a part of routine health checkup which every pregnant woman must undergo. Some of the other tests may also include some diagnostic scans. Now let us see what tests are included in ANC. In ANC, we include hemogram, urine routine, blood sugar, blood group, and HIV. Now, let us talk about these tests one by one. First of all, let us see what is hemogram. Hemogram is a test that checks levels of hemoglobin in the blood. It is very important to have adequate amount of hemoglobin to nurture the fetus. If the levels of hemoglobin is low in blood, the fetus may not develop in well manner. The next test is blood group. It is very important to check the blood group so as to avoid a condition known as RH incompatibility. If RH incompatibility is diagnosed, then immediate treatment must be taken. The next test is blood sugar. High levels of blood sugar, that is diabetes, can complicate any pregnancy. It is highly advisable to keep your blood sugar normal during and before the pregnancy. Also, if you have a family history of diabetes, it's advisable to talk to your doctor before conceiving. The next test is urine routine. For urine routine test, an early morning sample is required. It checks for WBCs, proteins, and bacterial infections. This is a test to rule out HIV infection in early pregnancy. This test helps in monitoring the maternal health. Also, it helps doctor to plan cesarean. The other tests check for hepatitis B and syphilis. These tests are also very important for the mother and the fetus. Along with this, double marker test triple marker test and quadruple marker test is also required. The marker test, that is double marker test, triple marker test and quadruple marker test, they look and screen for genetical or chromosomal abnormalities. These abnormalities include Down syndrome, Patau syndrome, Edward syndrome, trisomy 18 and trisomy 13. Along with this, torch test is also required to avoid any congenital infections. Along with all these tests, some diagnostic scans are also performed. These diagnostic scans include ultrasound and echocardiography. These tests are not done all together. They are done at specific time during the pregnancy. So chat, for example, double marker test is done in first trimester and triple marker test is done in second trimester. You must talk to your doctor before taking any of the tests. Your doctor will make a proper schedule for you to take these tests. Also, do not try to skip any of these tests as each of the tests is very important for the health of mother and the fetus. A quick reminder, it is important for you to get tested from a reputed and reliable lab. A link to a reputed and reliable lab will be provided to you in the description below. If you have any questions or any suggestions, feel free to comment down below. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy. 